What is up guys? It is D Diddy 171 here bringing you a commentary on the new map pack uh, uh Uprising Encore. You know, honestly, I thought I was going to really really hate this map, but you know, it's okay. I mean, it's not my favorite. I like Studio a lot better. I started really like uh, Mob of the Dead. Uh I'm using the Vector K10, probably my favorite weapon in this game. So, and with a uh, quick draw and uh reflex sight. That's all you need to know about that. But what I want to talk about is that Oh my goodness, YouTube drama alert, YouTube drama, oh my goodness, oh man, oh man, this YouTube drama stuff, oh boy, if you haven't heard, if you haven't heard, uh, it looks like Jay Nasty and Thunder Toro, a soldier, and some other guy, I forgot his name, uh, he, they're basically going after it, and it's actually, it's oh, actually hilarious, just seeing... Uh, just, just cover YouTube drama, you know, just the stuff that goes on here is just, you know, it's hilarious, especially in the gaming division, but I did hear that YouTube get, uh, on, uh, the, a uh, more popular channels like Shane Dawson and also those, uh, those, uh, makeup channels, the, the drama that happens on that YouTube stuff, it's, it's a lot worse than it comes, to, when it comes to the gaming division, but basically Jay Nasty, here, here's the thing, Jay Nasty, Jay Nasty. You saying that Thunder is talking crap to you. And what is he going to do about it? And yet you are just basically a puppet. You're dancing. You are a dancing fool. And yet you're 22 years old, man. Oh my goodness. And also, you're just complaining that, Oh, Dr. Toro, he couldn't get a gameplay because, uh... Because because he's such, he's such an average player, he's not a beast like me, so he had to go into combat training mode. Oh, get on my navel. Well, here's the deal. Here's the deal, Day Nasty. One, who cares if he's in combat training mode? Honestly, I don't care about gameplay. Honestly, I don't care. If it's because there's so many people with gameplays out there. I don't really care. I don't. I don't care. You probably went to combat trade mode when you first get into the map because you gotta know all the nice little camping spots that you go to when you get in your uh, in all the little alleyways so you can get your 100 plus game plays. You know. I uh, hope you do that, and you probably do. If you if you're not, you're probably lying. And also, one other thing, what do you do for society, Jay Nasty? You know, Thunder. He he saves lives. He's a firefighter. What do you do, Jay Nasty? Honestly, do you just do gameplays and just sell, see how beastly you are with your 100 plus gameplays? <laughs> wow, Jay Nasty. If you really think that, uh, and basically you're, you basically call your subscribers all slut or slut bags and you call them whores and all that stuff. Seriously, bro, you sound, I mean, honestly, I don't care how you get your gameplays. Honestly, you can get bots and all that stuff and get 100 plus gameplays. I won't care. You will hear a peek from me. But what I have a problem with is that you, Jay Nasty, basically treat your subscribers like crap. Okay? One, if you're if you're calling someone a slut bag, you probably should be a bitch slapped right in the ha right in the face, dude. Honestly, I would do that if I was a woman. You called me a slut. I probably would have. I probably would have bitch slapped you. And the other thing is that why? And you, also, you're sounding like. You're whoring them for, well, for money, but I don't really care about that. But you're whoring them for gameplays, dude. Honestly, I've looked at your friends list and basically always, almost always, they're on the opposite team, dude. And honestly, it sounds like you're ca you're causing trouble. And also, you're whoring your subscribers that are your friends that you say that you add them to your friends list. You're whoring them for gameplays and honestly i don't think that's right i mean i don't think that's right especially since you never give them a shout out at all or never give them credit for your beast gameplays you know honestly you know what i'll say i'll say this if you have all your friends that are your subs in your gameplay where you have your 100 plus stuff why don't you just list them just say i want to thank this person, this person, this is your channel, this is your channel, this is your channel. Because, you know, they they deserve credit too because, you know, if without them, you, without them, you yelling at them or you yelled them at them going easy, go easy on the tag, guys. You're, oh my goodness, you're, you, you, you took my tag. I can't get my, can't get my swarm anymore. Oh my gosh. You know, at least they, honestly, I think at least they deserve a shout out, you know, or I don't say a shout out, but at least put them in their subscription to, you know, 
to uh, give them credit for their work, basically being their your bit you slaving them for your 100 beast gameplay. So that's that's that that just blows my mind, dude. That you don't even do that. So every time you have you're in a full party. And you're having this beast gameplay with all your friends, with your subscribers that are helping you out because you're yelling at them to go easy on the tag. Why not give them a little shout out? Honestly, each one. I don't care if it's just, I mean, honestly, I don't care if you have one. I think you should do them all because they all deserve credit, dude, for your gameplay that you, you that you give out. Uh, see that lag over there? Oh my goodness. And that guy's camping in the corner. He's trying to get his beast gameplay. I don't know what that guy's doing. And here's another big thing that really, really bothers me, Jay Nasty. Is that that you do not take criticism very, very, very well. Here's the deal. I sent you a tweet yesterday or two nights ago, I forgot. Basically, when you are when you get on with Soldier and you're talking crap about him. And you're saying, and I was saying, why are you blocking people that give you a little criticism? That's the only tweet that I gave you. That I sent you. And yet you blocked me. Why? Because you're so butthurt that I gave you a little criticism for the way that you run your Twitter and how how well you, you carry yourself as a person? <laughs> Ridiculous. I thought you feed. I thought you feed off the criticism. I thought you feed off the hate. So why are you blocking people, bro? Why are you blocking people on Twitter? It sounds like you're just scared. You're just scared of people, honestly. And I just made, I basically did what I wanted you to do. And I wanted you to just block me and just get rid of me. So now I can make this video. Now, because you started something with me now. And honestly, how are you going to survive in life if you can't take a little criticism from people? You're saying, oh, screw the haters. And yet, if they give you a little criticism, you block them. Or you act like an immature child and say, Oh, if them, if them, they're no no like, oh my goodness. And they, they shock, they get, get on my Neville, man. Seriously, bro, you are acting like that? You are acting like that? On camera? For everybody to see? And everybody knows how immature you are? Oh my gosh, this, this is, honestly, I looked at your channel. And you're basically... Oh my goodness, I just had to laugh after you basically destroyed Thunder. Honestly, you didn't destroy Thunder. You just made yourself look like a fool, honestly. And you just dancing on strings. You, because you're on a strings, you keep dancing. You dance even more, son. You're dancing even more, son. Okay, what did we learn today? One, make sure if you're going to have a beast gameplay and you're, you're basically yelling at your teammates... To go easy on the tag. And you're basically helping them out. I mean, if those teammates are helping you out get your beast gameplays, at least give them credit for your beast gameplays by putting their name or their channel in your description. It seems that very, very easy, don't you think? And it doesn't seem like that you're basically, since you call them sluts and all that stuff, you're basically whoring them for views for yourself, for your own personal gain. And what else did we learn today? Ah, yes. Another thing that we learn is that Thunder's Jay Nasty Thunder's probably better at life than you, because he saves lives. And what do you do? Good question. Call me again when you get a real job or contribute to society, except for entertaining people with your 100 plus gameplays and your boring personality. And another thing we learned is that you will not go, you will not go anywhere in life if you can't take criticism correctly. And even though you say that you, that you, uh, you just brush out the criticism, yet you, yet you act like a little child on your videos when you have a little criticism. <laughs> Come on, son. Dude, is that how you're going to act? Seriously? And another thing, and the, another thing we learned is that who cares if about the gameplay? Who cares if you if you have in combat training mode, as long as it's entertaining, as long as it as it as long as it's entertaining, and as long as it gets you views, I don't care how you get your gameplay. Honestly, honestly, I have a guy. I have a guy. I'm not gonna name his names, but he has gameplay of just him in combat training mode. And do I complain about it? No, I actually defend him 
because he's trying to get better at the game. And I don't care, honestly. And yet you care, Jay Nasty? Seriously, bro? Just grow up and grow some balls, bro. Seriously, you will not go anywhere in life if you do not follow the steps I have to, at, that I have that I said. Contribute to society and take criticism better instead of acting like a little child. And who cares about the gameplay? Honestly, who cares about the gameplay as long as it gets you views? Honestly, I really don't care. This is D Diddy. Peace out and stay classy, friends.